Hi guys, my name is Messi Johnson Okoje, wife, mom, entrepreneur, actor, and you are watching 24 Hours Nollywood First. Don't touch it. That's the right place to be. Just a little bit. Promise me if anything happens to me, and you take care of yourself. Hmm. This is what I'm feeling now. I think I'll soon be joining your father. Here we go. Water. I have a little problem here. She's 
she has no strength to push her. And if she eventually dies, the baby will die. Wanyiki, you see, we do not have an idea of who she is. We just met her on our way from a far journey. And we discovered she was in labor and helpless. Uh, so we decided to uh, to help her by bringing her to us. By bringing her to you. I don't think she can survive. Please help us. I don't think so. Do everything you can do for her to survive, please. Yeah, please, why you can. But let me go straight and see if I can save the life of the people. Okay, go, go ahead. Go. It's a girl. Oh. The gods be praised. How is the mother doing? She didn't make it. Um, this is no goodness at all. But I tried to save the life of the people. Mm -hmm. Correct. But I told you. Okay. Yes, we know. But no one knows where, where the woman came from. And yes. where is she going to? Hmm. Both of you should look for a way to dispose her remains. I shall not take any carry from you. That is my own contribution. Yeah. Uh, thank you. Uh, we shall let us find a way to dispose of her uh, body, like uh, she said. Then, if you other thing, we follow. I will go inside and take care of it. Okay. Huh? Uh, John, Uh, you, you know the situation surrounding my marriage. Uh, for years now, uh, I've been married and no issue. So I want to suggest if I can take her to my house so that my wife can take care of her. I so okay. okay, Mama. Nemo, olevi no, onye kamga kosara, onye kamga bakuru, iku abu onu mo, ariri ebu la mo. Nemo, olevi no, nemo, olevi no, onye kamga kosara. What is it again? You are looking so worried. He said, Bubi. What about her? Since she went to the mountains, she's supposed to be back by now. Uh, I, I, I don't I, know what is keeping her. I know she does not stay this long on the mountains, but it's not enough reason for you to be worried like this. What is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? Take it, take it. You want it. Bitch, I'll let me again. Please leave them alone, don't kill them. No, no, I can, no, don't say that again. I want to kill them. Get the house. See, this useless mm. and robber stole my power. Oh. Then you know now, catch them. Today I will teach them a little. Bitch, I want to teach them. Get the house. 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 Get the house.
kill them. Please leave them, Joe. Papa, they say again, I'm going to if I give it to you, you will not like yourself. If I give it to you, you will not have enough stamina to carry it. To you. Hey, okay, you're the one that sent her to come and insult me. No, 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 I've won you time without number. I've won you time without number. Leave my brother Ibuke alone. Hapo ya aka mwa, hapo ya aka. Hapo ya aka, hapo ya aka, this girl. Nonsense. Why now, eh? Why? We are sorry. Come, let's go, Jo. Come, let's go. Maka, I can't go with you. I have to run errands for my mother. What is it? Whatever you do, hmm? don't cross her path. Eh? I should not do it. I should not cross her path. I will cross her path. And I pray that day, Giwa, you will be there to see it. Kutalo kwam. Kutalo mno. Drop the fire with you. Drop it at all. Everybody, come here. Hold your two ears with your hands. How many times have I told you about fighting in this village? How many times? Papa, but I didn't want to fight them. They stole my firewood. Will you shut, shut, shut up? Now listen to me. If I ever hear you and fight in this village again, what I will do to you, you will never imagine it. You won't do that for me. Do you understand? Ebube! Ebube! You, you, you better talk to her.
What's wrong with you? Eh? So I'm now too small that you will pass without noticing me. Eh? I'm sorry, Biko. Yourself, what what is your own? What's your own? Yeah. Mind your business, so. Amaka, come back here. Amaka. Amaka, come back here. See, let me tell you something. If you don't come back here, when I get home, I'll, I'll, I'll beat you. You will beat me. Oh dear. I'm not going to I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. She has taken over the glory of everyone in the village. So what's her own? It will be beat up some boys today for stealing her firewood. <laughs> That's good for them. Good for them. <laughs> I want you to join me so I will go and check my truck. Okay. Treating you well and not being fast. Mama, you've not loved me. Then why do you feel this hurt with your bitter tears every day? I miss my mother greatly. I miss her so much. It's been 12 whole years now. I know. It seems like yesterday. I just wish I could set my eyes on her once more. But please, don't worry. If your mother is still alive, the gods will lead you to her someday. Please, be happy. For me, oh no. have I not been a good mother to you? You have, Mama. Stop crying. Don't it's okay, me. it's okay. Me. It's okay, I won't cry again. I love you so much, Mama. And I appreciate you so much. <laughs> Amaka, what is it? You look like you just fell from a Nudala tree. Just leave me alone. Leave me alone, no. You know I cannot leave you alone now, eh? You're my friend. Eh? Is it not that, that stupid girl? Which stupid girl? Why are you? Why are you pretending? Why are you pretending that you're not the one that sent us to come and beat me up? Why are you pretending? I'm busy, Abube! Go away. Leave me alone. This man who has leave me alone now. Leave me alone. Leave me alone now. Sorry, ma. Sorry. I don't want to rest, ma. Leave me alone. I want to rest. Hey. Aro. Aro. You boys have disgraced one. How can a girl be the three of you? How? Strong. Uh, uh, see, Vaga. Ebube. It's not just an ordinary girl, no. That girl, Ebube. 
She has unusual strength of the ghost. One is Oku Kiku. How can a girl hold the three of you? A trance up. And you're here telling me nonsense. A girl that bends down to the net. If you're on a make wound. Hey! Okaka, why are you disturbing yourself? Eh? Why are you telling Obaka anything about him? If you know you are a strong man and you have a booby as you this you a booby is like this. Go and fight her and stop disturbing us. Exactly. Boy. Go and fight her. Are you yes. hearing what I'm saying? Yes. I said you should go and fight her and see if a worse plight than that of us will not be a lot. Just go and fight her. Mm -hmm. You see. Yeah, right, yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. See, you took my mission like this. That girl will be across my path. What I'll go to her. <laughs> you people not hear the night. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. You think I'm a shimmer like three of you? Huh? 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 Okay, no problem. We are shimmers, eh? Mm. We are shimmers. You are the strong man. Oh, yeah, go and fight her. Mm. Shimmers, even. Kaip one, strong man. Stay here and fight everybody. Everybody, I have to hear this. I'm going to how you go about fighting the whole voice in this village and humiliating them? But you see me back. You see me back. Any day you cross my path, what I'll do to you, eh? you will not believe it. I will show you the stuff we men are made of. Hey, I will fear around. Hey, baby. Obaka is insulting you. Obaka insulted you now. Eh? I do not have time for useless boys like you all. Hey, me? Hey. Hey. Oh, Baga, she uh, called me a useless boy. <laughs> See this girl here? She didn't say anything while I was talking to her. What do you ah. mean by that? <laughs> if you are strong, touch her. Oh, Baga, go and go touch, touch her. Exactly. Oh. You can do anything. Do you want me to touch her? Yes! Touch her. Ah, touch her. Give her the pussy fat. Do your worst! Do your worst! Hey, but do your worst! Join me! Join me! Join me! Join me! Join me! Join me! Everybody, you're not doing anything. Yes, everybody's afraid of you. Yes, everybody's afraid of you. I won't be our papa. I won't know more. We think it is you. Hey, I won't. 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 And where is your water pot? Father, were you not the one that told me never to fight again? Those boys broke my water pot for no just cause. So you let them go away, just like that? I told you never to fight again, yes. But I never told you to be stupid. I ask you for the last time, where is your water pot? Talk to me, where is your water pot? I'm going to get it. You better be fast. Oh, 
Which of them? Then you can stand up and fight me. What's going on here? Nemuku goes with that. Ah, Otenku! Carry him. Let, let's take him to Ebuna's hut. Let the wonder girl perform her wonder. See her inside. She's there. She's inside. Ah, yes. Okay, uh, there's something I want us to discuss. Yeah. Um, you know the circumstances surrounding her birth. How you and your friend picked her up on the roadside and how 
come from what I've done. I give him what I have. She must be a special child from the dogs. Uh, keep him down here. Keep him down here. What is going on here? My people. Can you from? Can you from? My dear. Otenku, my brother, the famous pan wine tapper in this village, fell down from palm tree and died. So we brought him to your daughter because she is our only hope of bringing him back to life. Please go inside and bring our daughter to go. My people, what do we do? Because the person you are looking for, she is not around. Mazi, we shall continue to wait until she comes back. Because we don't have alternative, have we? No. There's no need to wait. One, this people. I already know that. Talking about appreciation for the way your daughter brought back my life to me. Um, no matter how small, we can manage it. You know, I know that nothing can be compared to the life your daughter brought back to me. Don't touch him, you're not safe. Okay, go. My love. Take back those things. For you owe nobody any appreciation. If you say so, but one more thing, I want to thank you for the way you brought me. You may go. Huh? Go! People of Umokoro village. Ojiako and his wife picked her up from the bush. Why would she be a terror to the entire village? Eh? On Apuara? To the extent of killing the son of Umokoro. No. She must be killed. Yes. She has done more than is required. Even Ojiako and his wife shall be banished from this village for bringing home a girl that killed our own son. Ha! They, they deserve worse than that. It should be made to partake from the seal of Ebube. Aru. Aru! Aru! What have you done? It was Unai that sent me back. Where? Where did I send you to? Did I send you to go and kill someone? No, did I? Nah, I didn't know he was going to die. Now he is dead. Listen to me. If you know what is good for you, you better run out of this village as fast as your legs can carry you before the angry youths of this land invade this place. You will start running now. Nay. I should run out of this village. Nay, where do you want me to go to? I don't have anywhere to go to. To your village, of course. Where you came from. Oh, my people wanted us dead. 
They banished my mother and I. Even if I go back to that village, they would not accept me back. And I do not throw me out. Please. See, you have to go back. Maybe your mother has gone back to Mimo. No, my mother cannot go back to Mimo. She can't. I know what she can do. They banished us. They didn't want us. They did not like us. Listen to me. Be whatever it is, you cannot stay here. Go back to your place. <laughs> Daughter discussion that I used to have with her. Where do I start from? I perfectly understand how you feel. There is nothing we can do. Just try the best you can to adjust. All I know is that wherever a baby is, Finding it easy to. It's not going to find it easy to. But as it is now, we don't have any choice. Oh, Bim, it's okay. Stop crying. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Now, bring her out! Oh, what, or else? What girl are you talking about? Who is that little daughter called Ebube? 
It should not matter lives here. What? Gilly! Yes, after the incident, she fled. Why not? No, no. Go in there! Run everywhere! Bring that girl! She's not there! She's not there! I don't tell you lies! Shut up! Hey, hey, shh! But I cannot tell you lies. Shut up! No. For ambition, you shall partake of our sins. You shall first of all provide that gate to us until you do. Your freedom shall not be given to you. No lie! I am a free born of this land! No! I have the right! Don't take my freedom! I am not going anywhere! I am not going anywhere! Move! 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 Igwe, so you are the one that troubles this land. Igwe, far be it from me that I trouble my people and my land. Where is that young girl you brought into your home? Where did you get that beast? Igwe, a bube is not a beast. So many years ago, I and my wife saw her at the Ikba forest. My king, you know how deadly that forest is. Ebube was crying as she told us her story. We took pity on her and we decided to bring her home. My king, what wrong have we done by giving a helping hand to, to a dying soul? You did a lot of wrong bringing her into this kingdom. She is evil. She is not a human. Hmm. Obu, Obu. Igwe. Where is that young girl? Speak before I sentence you. Igwe, she had fled to an unknown destination after her incidents with Ubaka. I don't know where she is. It's a lie. You are a liar. You are protecting her. You are a big liar. Igwe. If you know where that girl is, send words to her. Get her to this palace. Until then. You and your wife shall remain captives and prisoners in this palace. Yes. Until you provide her to pay for her sins. Igwe, please, now. Wallace! Wallace. Take two of them to the back of the palace. Oh. Tie them to the oh. Igwe. Igwe. Igwe, because Two guys shall keep watch on them. Igwe. They shall neither eat nor drink until they provide that young girl. As I have said, so shall it be done. It is so shall it be done. We are free born of this land. We are free born of this land. Move, move, move. Give me a hand. Free born of this land. Move, move, move. Give me a hand. 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 Move, move, move. What wrong did we do to you? We only brought you home to help you, Ebube. See the problem you have put us through. Obim, mm. stop lamenting. Mm. What we did, we did for humanity. She mm. only acted in anger and self-defense. Oh. This is our fate. Let us learn to accept it. <laughs> Ebula! Ebula! Please! 
Talking to my voice and save a life. Save a life? What life are you talking about? My heart was invaded this afternoon by dogs. Dogs? Uh, from where? I don't know. But supposedly from Umoko village. They made their way with my pot of curry and even with my two daughters. Uh, Mazuruka, is that why you are here? <laughs> yes. Ah. Okay. Does this place look like a palace? Eba o yilugo base. Mazin to ka ebo yilugo base. Even the even the Igwe could not proper solution to me. So I went to this house of solution. My house is now a house of solution. <laughs> okay, okay. What solution do you want? You know what I mean. Your daughter, Wando. <laughs> My daughter. She's sleeping. I'm sorry, she cannot go with you. Hmm? Hey! Yeah. Everyone, uh, everyone. My, my advice is just bear whatever you've lost to them. Eh? You okay now? I can't do me. Hey! Everyone! Everyone! Hey. I am not asleep. Thank you. Take me to the place and I'll find you. Thank you. Go on, this way. This way. Ah! <laughs> 
These girls are beautiful. Look at their bodies. Can't you take a test of them before selling them tomorrow morning? You are right. These girls will be so sweet. By now, Mazenduka must have reported us to the village warriors. And they might be looking for us now. I suggest we take these girls to our base first. You and I know that there's no way we will start going to the houses one after the other. It is true. Let's enjoy our cash, Pico. Okay, if you say so. She's very pretty. Three boys, three girls. Follow all the way. <laughs> oh, good. Yes. Oh, oh, oh. The God, the praise, brought you down to this village. Take your daughter's school. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bella. Let's go. <laughs> Wando has really affected a lot of lives in this village. She's, she's indeed God sent to this community. Um, there's no doubt about that. But the only problem I have with her problem is her refusal to accept gifts from people. I believe if she can start collecting gifts from people, then we'll take it as it goes. Have decided to compensate us for the good we did several years ago when she was better. Nani, if she has refused to collect gift items from people, then you let her be. After all, no one knows the source of her magical powers and the secret behind this. We are not trying to say we should impose it on people. But I'm trying to say if people bring gifts, you know, out of holiness of their hearts, we should accept it. I don't see anything wrong in uh, accepting gifts from people when they did it willingly. That is. That is if it does not contradict her spiritual laws. Ah, Shut up your mouth. 
you know anything about her? Nani, no. let her be. Let her be. I don't need to ask you the purpose of your visit to my house this early. <laughs> you are right. <laughs> Our people say, mm. any man who does not know where rain start beating him, mm. We definitely not know when it stops. You are right, you are right. No far forgets who removes his feathers during the rainy season. But <laughs> I have come to show appreciation for what your daughter, Wando, did for my family yesterday. Nanyan no, Doka. But you know that my daughter does not accept this kind of appreciations. Huh? Uh, uh Mazendoka. This is women talk. You know the way they talk. It's quite different from the way we talk. So forget uh -huh. about her. Uh -huh. In addition, uh -huh. this is my two daughters have volunteered to be helping you in your housework. Whenever the need arises, call on them. Yes, Nai. Nai, want to give us back our lives and freedom. Who knows where those slave traders would have taken us to, if not for one of those help? Thank the gods. So in a way to show appreciation, we can always come to help you out. Let us even start by fetching water. Where do we get your pots? Just go behind there. Okay. <laughs> You see? Oh. <laughs> um, come, come, bring the gift. Right? Bring. Everything. Wanda, what did you hear? Who made you the gods? So I said talking about this. No, I did not tell him to bring anything. He brought it on his own. The gods are my witness. Please, I, I didn't ask. Please. Make haste now with your words. Else, you will bring domination upon yourself. Go now! <laughs> Take back your gifts. I don't want to incur the wrath of the gods upon my family. Please. Is there any problem? No. There's no problem. It's just that one who does not need any appreciation from you. No, if the gifts are not enough, let me get to my No, that's no, no, not what I'm talking about. Please, 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 please take it back. Take your gift, please. Please. Hey, please, the cow is too. Or even the cow is. Yes, please, take. Look, do I come more and No, no, you don't need to come with me. Oh, Wonder, the one that girl. Greetings one sent from the gods. The gods. Ah. Only the gods. Is that the Not anymore. You are not in debt to me. But we are good to help. Just want to help. Ah. Let it not be on the basis of deliverance the gods gave to you. No, it's a special one. Good. Yeah. One those exploits are increasing by the day. Did she do any other thing? As if she's not always doing things. Last night, she saved Mazin Duka's daughters who were kidnapped by slave traders. Are you serious? They say that she used her powers on the men who almost escaped with the girls. If not that, Mazin Duka ran to Mazin Duka's hut that night for help. And the magical powers caused the men to fight and kill each other. And then Wando returned with the daughters. You know, sometimes, I begin to think that this girl was actually sent to this village to be a savior. Right there. 
Indeed, we now have a saving. My sister. Set their eyes on you. Run out of this place fast. There we go. You are right. Maybe she came. Yes. Let's go. Who came here? Who came here? Nobody was here. Liar! Liar! I had voices. We were discussing it. And you are hiding her. Speak up. We shall report you to the Igwe. You don't want to provide the girl? She keeps visiting you here. Igwe has to increase your punishment. I will. Miko, wait. I will talk. Uh -huh. she, she, she was here. But she, she fled as, uh, as soon as she heard you coming. Which way did she go? There, there. Just look at your wife, mom, entrepreneur, actor, and you are watching 24 hours Nollywood first. Don't touch it. That's the right place to be. She entered the village and they are searching everywhere too. Why would she enter this village? Where she know how? I want to go. Stop asking me a question. <laughs> I don't think she's going to this way. Africa, mm. you're right. Yeah. Let's stop this unfruitful journey. Yes. Let's go back and look after the captives being kept on our care. Over you. Let's go. People now greet her when they see her pass on the way. Makagene, that is foolishness. Me, greet this little girl. Why should I do that? Greetings, special. Greetings. Take your mother's 
Thank you. The God has saved you today. Please go. I came to see the wonder girl. What can I do for you? I came to say Keep your things. They are not needed. Also keep your furniture. It's still early. You can amend your ways. Go now. I will. Thank you.
Ça plus fun. To you, you will not be able to withstand it. Get out of here, else you will end up like them. Leave. Thank you, special one. Thank you, special, Thank you, special one. one. Thank, Thank you. you. She Thank shall you. pay for her sins. Yes. Let us go and get the warriors. Yes. Oh, <laughs> 
First, I know why they summoned us. Eh? One thing I know is that a tour does not run in the daytime for nothing. There must be something serious to this call. Let's go. But wait, this is just ordinary women garden. Nothing much. It's just gossip, gossip. Who say and who did not say? No, far from it though. This call is not all about who say and who no say. My spirit is telling me that there is something more serious to this call. Why Gabi Let's go. Wait for me, please. As the woman leader in this community, I summoned everyone here so as to tell you what I think we should do to help maintain peace, security, and love of this community. We all are aware how the God sent us a savior through Ebola and his wife, Okuako. That wonder girl has touched many lives, directly or indirectly. Since she does not want to accept any form of gift in appreciation, I am suggesting that we mobilize our daughters to go an errand for her and her parents, like fetching the water, fetching firewood, sweeping the compound. This will let her know that we appreciate every good work she is doing in this community. If anyone here has contrary opinion to this, she can say her mind now. I repeat, if anyone here has a contrary opinion to this, she can say her mind now. Nada, this question you are asking me now, why didn't you raise up your hand at the meeting and ask the question? Eh? Hmm. You want everybody to see me as enemy of progress, Abi? Eh? Hey. Okay, you don't want them to see you as an enemy of progress, Abi? Please, oh, don't ask me that question. Stop disturbing my peace. No, okay. I'm disturbing your peace. Before? Akuya, who's the word? See, if you want to listen to me, I think what the women leader said is the truth. Oh. It's good. For me, I'm okay with the decision. Eh?
Igwe, what are we going to do? It's three days now and that girl has not shown up yet. Eh? What are we going to do? Or are we going to continue waiting for her? I suggest we lay the punishment directly upon Ojaku and his wife. What punishment are you talking about? Have they not been under punishment since then? Now tell me. What punishment do you need? <laughs> the, pun the penalty should be passed upon Ojaku and his wife since the girl has left the village completely and there's no hope of her returning. What kind of suggestion is that? Are you going to kill a freeborn because of the sin of a slave? He is very right. They are the ones that brought her into this village. Therefore, they must partake on her sins. Enough! In the next breaking of the day, if that girl is still not found, the captives must be let go. There are three bonds of Umokoro village. As I have spoken, so shall it be done. Since you are unable to provide us with that strange girl, we cannot continue to hold you prisoners. I want to give you back your freedom today. But let me warn, if I ever hear that you and your wife later accommodated that girl in your heart, then you have left me with no other choice than to leash my rot on you. Than to unleash my rot on you. Those whom the gods have blessed with ears, let them use it judiciously. Warriors, Your Highness. Free them. Yes, Your Highness. Thank you very much, Igwe. May the gods favor you greatly. Igwe. It's okay, the gods of our land will take care of us. I, I, I hope nobody saw you entering this compound. Nobody saw me and made sure they've seen us before sneaking out of my head. Because if the king hears that you are here, he would kill us. The king, 
Living without you has been like a nightmare to me. I just pray things go back to the way it used to be. Now look at what you've cost yourself. You started all of this. I told you, I'm but you sorry. wouldn't listen. Nah, it's okay. Let's just go. I hope in. nobody saw you. Nobody. It's okay. Is that why you're shouting? No. Now hold your two ears. Huh? Hold your ears. Don't ever tell anybody about this. If I ever hear you mention this to any other person, <laughs> you know what you, your mother, start to lose. If I get angry with you. I did. I got this for nothing anymore. Don't forget to come and fetch me. What's the problem? We went to farm at the land between us and Umokuta. But we met Umokuta warriors there and they drove us out, the, out of the land. Yes, they said we shouldn't come farming on that land again, else they will kill us. Follow me. Time, what have you come back here to do again? If dead, they are free running to their death. Come and farm on the farmland. Let me see. Why are you people the selfish? Why are you wicked? Why do you want to take that which belongs to Umukura and Umukuta? Ah! Who are you to question our actions? I want you all, all of you, to leave this land. Let my people farm on it. <laughs> Who are you to command the trained waters of Umukuru? Live here this minute if you love your life, or you will pay with your blood. sure that no one from Umokute comes to farm on that land. What are you doing here? Igwe, what our eyes saw now, our mouth cannot see. What is that? Igwe, the people of Umokuta sent a spirit to fight us. What are you talking about? Igwe, she is a little girl but has strength powers. At the wave of her hand, mighty signs are performed. Igwe, she nearly killed us but we managed to escape. What? Just listen to yourselves, you fools. How can you run away from a battle with little Umokute village? How can you? Igwe, this has gone beyond the battle of physical strength. It has gone beyond battle of spears and swords. Igwe, that girl is something else, so Igwe. No way! 
No way! He had in your bar! Who more could they cannot tell me? They cannot take what rightfully belongs to me! I shall tell them that I am the greatest king and fearless king of Umokoro! If they try me, I want a burago! I shall live with their heads! I shall beat them! I can make this a way, I can make this a way, Murokute! Tell them no your woman of Kade Pepe! Tell me how my son! I shall be the best of friends, hand to hand. Give me my sword. Let me have my sword. I shall meet them, face to face, eye to eye, sword to sword. They are dead. Igbo ataburu abu. Igbo ataburu abu. Hey, that's a full moon a man whose house is on fire does not go to Jesus. And it is said that a stitch in time saves nine. How do we fight this battle now that Umo Kuta has resorted using spiritual names? Do we fold our hands and watch them take possession of the land we inherited from our forefathers? Igwe. I have a suggestion. Speak. I am all ears. That girl called a woman. According to the people who have seen her fight, they say that she possesses an unusual strength. The strength of the gods. I believe she is a perfect match to whoever Umoko has brought. Mm. The girl we are hunting to kill is the same girl we are resorting for her help. Maybe the reason the gods didn't allow us harm is for a time like this. There is nothing wrong asking her to come fight for us. We need that land. And we must do everything. We mustn't hesitate to do anything that will make us have that land. But, uh, <coughs> we have a big problem, girl. Since we sent her away from Oja Ojako's house, how can we look at her? No more has been. That she still sneak in and out of Ojako's house. If Ojako is someone to his parents, I believe we can convince him to lead us to You are not. The land at the boundary of Umokoro and Umokuta has been taken over by Umokuta. And they have a champion. A girl with special magical powers who fights a thousand warriors. But well, Papa, we have our own Ibu. Yes, we have our own Ibu. But the question is, does it have much powers to match with the girl in question? Papa, what is it about the land at the boundary? Who is the true owner of this land? I will tell you a story, my son. That was how Umokuro and Umokuta shared the land till date. But now Umokuta wants to take it from Umokuro. Never. This can never happen. How could they be so covetous to take away what was rightfully given to us by our great-grandfather. It does not end in talking. We have to fetch a bube. She is the only one that will save us from this wickedness and bring back the land to us.
warriors of our land, I greet you. The ego sent us to bring you to the palace now. What have I done again? What is it this time? Follow us to the palace and you shall be told. But my wife is not at home. How would she know where I have gone to? You have to follow us now. But that is the Igwe's order. But let's go. Now. Whatever you want it, she is there, she is right there. <laughs> 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 Sabin Kola. Igwe. Dek. Dek and eat. Oja. Yam. You are in the palace of the great king of Omokoro. It is not of evil that you are summoned here, but of good, of peace, and of the hope of Omokoro Kingdom. I am listening, Igwe. An important jewel is about to be taken away from Omokoro Kingdom, and it is only in your heart that a savior is found. You can save the jewel of Umokoro Kingdom. You are still speaking in riddles, Igwe. I don't understand. Our land at the boundary between Umokoro and Umokute has been seized. A girl with an unusual strength fought and drove away our warriors and gave the land to Umokute. That slave girl in your heart has the same power to match the girl and Rimokute. We want you to provide that girl for us. Let her go and display her spiritual skills on her fellow gifted girl. But my king, everybody knows that Ebube no longer lives with me. She ran away after the incident, and since then, she has not returned. Ojiako, are you sure you are saying the truth? Why would I be telling lies? Ojiako, listen very attentively. Nobody is going to give you any other punishment. We are aware that she still sneak in and out of your heart. Provide her now that we need her. Yes! Ojiako, Igwe will need your help now. We really need you. Bring that killer girl back to our village. Amaka, which killer girl are you talking about? Ibubu, of course. Hmm, who else? Who told you? I overheard my father telling my mother when he came back from the palace today. I don't believe you. If you like it, believe me. If you like, don't. It's just that. I'm scared. I'm scared that that girl will just come back and start making war with me. I'm just scared. The only advice I have for you is whenever she comes back to this village, you better make peace with her. Eh? You said she do what? Over my dead body. I will not do that. Yeah. Okay. I've said my own. 
I just pray. I just pray that wherever she is, that wild animals will eat her. Ah! I hate that girl. I hate that girl. <coughs> no. How are you even sure that this is not a plot by Digma and his chiefs to get hold of our child? I don't think so. Maybe they need our help. Who is even sure she will come back to visit us? She will. She definitely will come back. You know, Ebube has been so much attached to us. She can't stay long without coming to visit us. Even if the whole world is coming to an end, I know that she definitely will come. That I am sure of. Yeah, Nayo, uh, Nay. This world. Yeah. So, the fruit that the gardener rejected has suddenly become the best fruit in the garden. I don't want to disappoint the Igwe and his elders. Uh -huh. Was it your fault that she did not come back from last week? What is this? I am thinking of going to search for her. Where? Can you follow Huh? Where are you going to see her? Everybody is not in this, in this village, in Umokoro village. That same spot where we found her some years ago. My mind is telling me that she might be there. You just have to be careful. Eh? You trust these people so much. You trust Digby and his chips. I don't trust them. They may just want to trap you. Eh? I don't want anything bad to happen to you. Look at everybody you want. Eh? If something happens to you, I don't know what I'm going to do. Gembe Luma Alao Akaroje Nedonye Hello, <laughs> Wagine <laughs> Papa. Hey, baby. What are you doing there? Come down, come down. Please come down. Come down. Come down. Come down. Come down, please, come down. I didn't want them to hurt both of you. So I decided to, to leave here. After all, this is where I began. This is where my pregnant mother left me. After we were just being banished. <laughs> they banished us for something my mother never did. Oh, <laughs> 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 
commanded that you and your daughter be thrown out of this village for killing your husband. That is it. Me, you my own husband. I said throw her things out. I said go in and throw her things away. Be fast about it. You are not to step foot in Umwewu again. You have been banished. Diwe has spoken. Bam. Let us go. My husband. Please. Please. Don't do this to us. Please. Let's My go. husband. Please. <laughs> husband killer. smiled on you and on us your foster parents yes you will no longer stay here again you will go back with me to the house where you rightly belong go back to my house the ego is no longer sad with me not only that they want you back now the entire Umukoro kingdom wants you. Why? Why? If they wanted to kill me, why would they want me back all of a sudden? They want you to help fight for them. Yes. An ultimate fight that will make them secure in this place with you. and fight her that has strange and unusual strength. If you finally win her, not only shall you be seen as one of us and no longer seen as a slave, you shall be married to my son, the next king of this kingdom. Thank you, Igwe. She has promised to go for the fight. Yes. A jack step aside. I want her to do the talking herself. Ibube, please tell him what you told me. Ibube, please Ibube, tell him. I shall fight her and I shall win her. Ibube, she is stronger than me. I'm on my way to the Igwe's palace to behold her as she join our warriors to fight our enemies. You mean she's leading our village war? Yes! For me. What is it? What is it, young man? No. I came to see one though. You came to see one? For what? 
Him cannot allow us to rest. Ulegwa can one minute to be. Come, must we pack out of this place because of you people? One to one. Okay, now let me ask you. Does this place look like a palace? Does it? Eh? Why can't you go to your Igwe to solve your problem and allow us to be? What is it? Nay, our king cannot help us in this matter. It is, it is only one though, the special one that can save us. I'm very sorry. You can't see her. Eh? Better go. She's not in a good mood. I am here. What is it again? The warriors of Umokuta came and drove us away from the land again. What? Yes. So because I let them leave the other time, they will hear it from me. Let's go. Wando! Wando! Thank you. 
Had the noise going on around in the village. What noise? Ha, Papa, our own Ebube has done it. Tell me what. Our own Ebube has fought and defeated the champion of Umokuta and restored back our land. You mean it? As I am talking to you right now, the Igwe is calling for celebration in his palace. Oh, that's good. I must not wait to miss this one. I must run to the palace immediately. Papa, we need to be there. We need to be there, Papa. Ewe! Hey! People of Fumokuta village! Have you seen what you have caused? Have you seen it? Ah, everything! Wando! 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 If somebody sick, Wando! If somebody dies, Wando! Wando! Look at her! Look at her! Hey! Is she your ghost? I am our mother who do not have faith! Thank the gods! The medicine man was able to revive you! Oh, mother, there is something peculiar about that girl. The first time I met her, my magical powers worked. But this time, I don't know. Something is wrong. Oh, no. There is something strange about that girl. Who is she? Wanda, they say she possesses the same power like you. And maybe her powers are stronger than yours. No, whatever it is, it's in the past. Okay. Thank the gods, my daughter is okay now. It's not in the past. You mean you have not heard of My sister, I've not heard anything of you. Please tell me. Our own wonder girl was almost killed to be a fight. Amadioha! Are you serious? Very serious. I heard that as soon as she saw the champion girl from Umokoro village, her powers left her. And the girl almost killed her but left her at the point of death. Amatioha! This is not a good story at all! My sister, not at all. Hey! But I heard that the champion was the first girl she almost killed but saved her life at Inca's river. She's that same girl. She's that same girl. So what happened this time around? And why was she unable to use her power on her, on her again? My dear, I think it's only the girls that can answer that question. Hey! Go inside and drop your firewood and come with me to my house. Let's see things for ourselves. You mean see the magical girl? Yes. No. They said Mazebuna is very upset and does not want to see anyone around his house. You know he's very angry with the people of this village. <sighs> Igbona has never liked the way that girl is using her magical powers to save the people of this village. I guess the chance he has always been looking for has been granted him. 
we'll see you later. All right. Bye-bye. Why? So you have to go back to them. Let them prepare for us. My son will be coming to pay your bride price in four market days. Thank you, Your Highness. You don't need to thank them. You need to thank your God, your chief, who endowed you with such strange powers. To the extent of our, our beating the strange girl in Umu, it's a bit Yes. She's not old. They said her parents brought a medicine man who revived her. They are not her parents. According to stories, Eguna and his friend met a pregnant woman along Ipa Road many years ago, helplessly in labor. They took the woman to Wanyike, the physician, who helped her to give birth. But according to them, the woman died in labor. But that daughter survived it. Hmm. Ebuna took the little baby home since his wife is barren. Since no one knows the true identity of the woman. That child is one. Hmm? Uh, Ichi, did you say at Ibaru? Yes, at Ibaru. Not only that, the problem is not winning the war with the royals. Amu, what is it? What is it? She's now the hero. She's now the hero. And we'll be getting married to the great son. I'm happy for her. And you have to be happy too. You know, I may have told you to make peace with her. How do I go about it? No, tell me. How do I go about it after all I did to her? Have you forgotten? I'm going to see her tomorrow. To see her? Yes. So that she will fight me again. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, in a one minute. My name is um, Ebube from Umibo. I am looking for Mazebuna's home. Hey. Is it Mazebuna that you're looking for or the daughter Wando? Actually, it's the daughter I'm looking for. Hey, Wando cannot see anybody now because she just survived death from the hands of a stranger, a girl from Urumu And Anna, it, it's all right, but let me just see her. Ha. Okay, come on, you cannot. See no, her. no, please don't go like that. Baba, <laughs> and it's not like I want to hurt you or something. Please, I desperately need to see her right now. It's important. It's urgent. Please, how do I do? Please, you can do it. I know you have a good heart. See, I beg you in the name of the gods of our land. Please, don't say me to me. Please, okay. one minute. Please, I know you have a good heart. Please. Okay, please. I will show you their heart, but don't let anyone know that I'm pressing at you. Don't worry, even if they know, there will be no problem. Let's go. So, which way are we? Let's go this way. Okay, this way. Okay, can, we, can we just run? Okay. Thank you. Hi. You're such please. a nice girl. Don't let them know. Don't worry. Don't yeah. worry. Everything will be alright. Where, 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 where? This is where? Okay. okay. What is it? What do you want? Please, I... She's not in good health condition. 
I don't want you people to disturb her. Ah, what is all this? You want her to die finally before you people will leave her? Nah, I have not come to fight. I came in peace. I don't need your peace. Okay, fine. But before I leave, there's this story about my life that I've come to confirm from you. My mother was unjustly banished. For me. For something she never did. I was little then. And she was nine months pregnant. On her way at Ibarri, she started screaming and asking for water. I rushed to Ia's river to get her water. But when I returned, she was nowhere to be found. I cried, I screamed. I searched for her everywhere. I didn't see my mother. I didn't see anyone that saw her or knows her whereabouts. Okay. It's alright. That's why I'm here, sir. Several years ago, my friend and I were returning from Omo. On our way at the bar, we met a pregnant woman that was under labor. She couldn't help herself. I, my friend, we decided to help her by taking her to the place where she uh, uh, had her baby. One day, this happened. Sister. Yes, according to your story, she is your sister. But my sister, I fought. You! You! What are you doing here? Father, what is going on? Man, calm down and hear her out. I never knew you were my biological sister. I've searched for you everywhere. I am sorry for everything that happened. I miss you. I am so happy to see you. Look at you. Look at you. You've grown into a beautiful young girl. I am sorry, my sister. Forgive me. So good to see you. I'm so happy to see you. Come, um, Mazimbuna, please, can you take us to where our mother is? She died after giving birth to her. So our mother is here. It's just you and I. You and I. You die on this earth. <laughs> I'm so happy to see you. You're the only thing I have left on this earth. I am sorry. I am ever sorry for laying my hands on you. Come. Please. Can you take us to where our mother was buried? Let's just... Let me Let's, go. Let's go. Hey, Bube. Wando. Come on, let's go so that I can go to farm. Let me show you the place. Who is she? Mother. That's our mother. That's our beloved mother. My children. Stop crying. The storms are over. What was meant to bring evil has turned to bring joy and abundance to you, my daughters. Mother, when you were unjustly banished, on our way at Ipanu, you asked for water 
I said, let me go to Ia so I get you what I'm gonna. But when I came back, I didn't see you again. I, I searched for you everywhere. I cried, I weeped. I've been in pain since that day to date. I'm so glad I've seen my sister one day. I'm sitting there when I went to your grave before you appeared to us. We miss you so much, mother. I wish you were here now. It have been the best moment of our lives. But we can't question the gods. The gods, we are not happy. The way we were unjustly treated. That was why, at my death, they empowered the God of you with strange and magical powers to make you outstanding and to repay you for everything you lost in me. What you are seeing now is just the beginning. Your greatness shall know no limits. Your unusual strength and magical powers will attract kings and noble men from every part of the earth. So have the gods the priests. And so shall it be. Be safe. Mother. I thank the gods. I thank the gods for allowing me to see the woman that gave birth to me. But I have missed you. You are so beautiful. I thank the gods. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Entrepreneur, actor, and you are watching 24 hours Nollywood first. Don't touch it. That's the right place to be. <laughs> 